Splendid Cartoon. She basically starved herself. People die from starvation, you know. Oh God, please help me. Was she boycotting food or did someone force her not to eat? Um, yes. Yes to what? She has not eaten for the past few days. How could you have let this happen? I didn't think it would. She hasn't acted like this before. What would this extent? She will be alright. But she needs attention now. Okay. You have to watch her very well. She's exhibiting signs of an onset of depression. You will have to specially monitor her if she starts showing suicidal tendencies. God forbid! What's my daughter? This is not a matter of God forbid, madam. You need to check whatever it is that is aggravating your daughter. Ha! Benita! How do I... If she could let herself go to this point, there is no telling what she can do if left unwashed. Madame Kufu, she's your only daughter. I don't think any quarrel or issue is worth losing her over. Hmm. She can go on tomorrow. Her health is up to you now. Do be careful with her. Thank you, Doctor. If I should stay, only be in your way. So I go, but no, think of you. Every step of the way Oh baby Be the sweet memory That's all taken with me So goodbye Hey, I recognize you But the girl is first becoming popular as the voice I do not think of myself as popular Well, you do have a lovely voice and use it so well. Thank you. My name is Uchi. Um, can I buy you lunch? I would love to hang out with you, get to know you a little better. It's a lovely thought, but I have a boyfriend. I'm not going to let her win just like that. She will not ruin my relationship with Marvelous, just for no reason. But I have to be smart now. What do I do? Yes. I'll tell her I am pregnant. She can't do anything then. How did I think of this Benita, sooner? please come and eat. Do you want to faint again? Did the doctor remember to tell you that I am pregnant? Hmm? You heard me right. I am pregnant. And I'm not getting rid of it. For, for who? You know who? Who? Marvelous. Yay! Ha! Benita! Ha! Aye, me, te, me, ba, me. Be overreacting, dear. This girl has finished me. Your plan won't work. Benita, what are you saying? You have to separate me and Marvelous because of your own selfish reason. If there is one at all, and I'm telling you that it's not going to work now because I am carrying this baby. Kilele, you so bai. Oh, God. Why are you shouting like this now? Ordinary pregnancy. I want to bring down the building. Am I a small girl? Hmm. <laughs> My greatest fear. So you don't want me to get pregnant at all? Ha! Ah, Benita, you won't understand. You started again. Understand what? Benita, he's your brother. Eh? Marvelous is your brother. <laughs> You're playing with me. I swear. I swear with all I hold there. So you hate Marvelous so much. You can even lie to separate us. 23 years ago, I met Marvelous' father in the hospital. Wounded, stranded, and with no memory of his past. I decided to help him and I brought him here. I didn't know who he was or that his wife would later turn out to be my friend. After some weeks, he regained his memory and returned to his family. But by then, I was already pregnant with you. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you and Marvelous cannot be together. You are siblings. It's a lie. I don't believe you. <laughs> you are such a clown. A sweet clown, though. My own sweet clown. <sighs> I can't remember the last time I slept and had a dream that didn't get interrupted by your voice on phone. This is the third hour you've been on that call. It is the wee hours of the morning, and your voice is really loud. Uh-uh. 
I'm trying to sleep now. Ahem, what were we saying before? This your roommate doesn't like me at all. Why don't you move in with me so I can always have you by my side? Hmm, this campus hostel self is too noisy. I will do just that. Can't wait, Shugri. Can't wait to... Don't worry, my disturbance won't be a bother anymore. I will move out. Are you for real? You're moving out? To where? Stop acting surprised. I told you I would leave. I think it's better to be in a place that is quiet. Or just place provides the right atmosphere. It would help in my reading. And this hostel is just too noisy. If it's not someone fighting, it is someone always knocking to ask for my gear or salt. Eh? So you think you'll be able to read your books when living with Ojo? Why not? Okay, I can't stop you. Today that Marbel did not come for Riazas, let's cast through together. <laughs> Being bore. You and this your way of words, Sha. I don't stay on campus anymore, do I stay in town now? Eh, uh -huh. big girl things I be. You staying alone? With my bobo, Ojo. Hi, Ronke. Hello ish to you too. You're hot. I admit that. But I really want to take you out. And I said I can't. I have a boyfriend. <coughs> you know, I love going out too, Sharp. My second name is Outdoor. Outing, outside, out. Will you keep quiet? Wait, I beg. Make I understand something. Bros Uche wants you. Now him, you tell him, say, you get bobo. You know Sabi say Uche in my black fever. What is black fever? Ah, black fever. Better caution. He's a cultist. Ah, uh ah, -uh, I carry water for mouth. I said he's a cultist. And you not only refused is asking you out because of your bobo, but you come add working out on him. On top of the matter, Better start to they do better video on top that your bubble head do. Ah! I better warn Ojo about him oh Hey God! But this guy makes sense now. Nah. You say reason the guy. He get your package weller. He's loaded and he go protect you. From what? Forget oh. We have the protection now. Nah. Reason and well. Oh. When she told me about Uche, the leader of the Black Fever cult, I was a mass of burning inferno. How dare you try to approach my babe? My own thing. Try to take away something that belongs to me. Now that I think of it, I think the anger wasn't about me being a jealous or protective boyfriend. I think it was about me defending my property from theft. So, I had to declare what was my territory and, well... What yellow fever people have done to you now, eh? Black fever. Anyone, Jerry? I told you not to go, you insisted. And I'm sure you gave them a dose of your malted medicine before they pounced on you this way. Ah, look at you. Did they want to kill you for me? Are you okay? I think so. I don't know, been feeling easily nauseated lately and, and tired. I think it's a symptom of malaria. Let's get you tested then. Congratulations, you are six weeks pregnant. Where? In your womb. Hey! I me to me, by me. You sound like you want to say something very serious. Marvelous. Yes? What? I don't even know where to start. Babe, is everything okay? Is it about the hospital? Believe me, I came to visit, but your mom wouldn't let me see you. She didn't even let me talk to you on phone. I know. You know I care about you. <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> Benita, why are you crying? You are scaring me. I don't know what to think. Think about what? My, my mom. What did she do? She said... She said... <laughs> She said we are siblings! Eh? Oh, it's normal talk. 
She once told me to take you as my sister. No, no, not like that. She said that you and I have the same father. What? Thank you, my people, for watching Splendid Cartoon. <laughs> Una too much. I beg, I want me to help me like this video. Come drop comment. Come share with any person where you sabi. You see that subscribe button? Hey, me na help me click that button. And that uh, come come bell. Where they decide that? Me na help me follow presser. So that anytime where we upload new video, una go know one time, one time. Una bye bye. Oh yeah, baby. Spring. Oh, love me. I spice. Oh yeah, yeah. La la, smoke oh, music. Me. Yeah, uh, uh, uh. If I should stay, only be in your way. So I go, but no. Think of you every step of the way Oh baby, be that sweet memory That's all taking with me So goodbye, so goodbye